डेफिनेशन ग्रेविटेशन इज अ नेचुरल फिनोमिन बाय विच फिजिकल बॉडीज अट्रैक्ट विद अ फोर्स प्रोपोर्शनल टू देयर मासेस ग्रेविटेशन इज मोस्ट फेमिलियर एज द एजेंट दैट गिव्स वेट टू ऑब्जेक्ट्स विद मास एंड कॉजेस देम टू फॉल टू द ग्राउंड व्हेन ड्रॉप्ड ग्रेविटेशन इज रिस्पांसिबल फॉर कीपिंग द अर्थ एंड द अदर प्लैनेट्स इन देयर ऑर्बिट्स अराउंड द सन एंड for the formation of tides plus laws kepler gives three laws they are stated as law of orbit all planets move in elliptical orbits with the sun situated at one of the foci of the ellipse law of areas the line that joins any planet to the sun sweeps equal areas in equal interval of time this law comes from the observation that planets appear to move slower when they are farther from the sun than when they are the nearer law of periods the square of the time period of revolution of a planet is proportional to the cube of the semi major axis of the ellipse traced out by the planet let t be the period of revolution around the sun and are the mean radius between the sun and the planet t square is directly proportional to r cube t square is equal to k r cube universal law of gravitation according to newton's law of gravitation every particle in the universe attracts every other particle with a force directly proportional to the product of their masses and inversely proportional to the square of distance between them the direction of this force is along the line joining the two particles for the two particles of masses m1 and m2 separated by a distance r f is equal to g m1 m2 upon r square the constant g is called universal constant of gravitation in spherical body the total mass can be supposed to be concentrated at its center 